Hi, it's Sandra here from Create in Spain and I have another card for you today. You might well want to put your sunglasses on before you look at this one. Now, I've included in the information below the SVG file for the card base, but the card base doesn't look quite like this. This piece here was cut from the end, so instead of it being just a crease there, I just cut it off because I've modified this particular file that I've made. So I cut it off, I put all my decor panels on, so there's one for the middle and here, and then on this side you have another couple of decor panels, and this one here I have raised upon foam tape. So that one is relatively chunky. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to do for the rest of the card. Now when I designed this, I designed it as sort of like an easel card to go up like so. But this is a variation of it, so I'm going to show you what I'm doing. I have a paper flower that I've made, and it's very, very simple. It's just daisy shapes. Cut out lots of them, and then... I put two lots together with, in this particular case, I have some silver elastic through the middle and I used hot glue to make sure that silver elastic stays put. So what I want to do now is to take my flower, put it underneath my card, but to put the silver thread over the top here and I need to glue this in place and I want it to go relatively close to the edge so I'm just going to take my glue gun which I've got heating up here and just going to put a good blob of glue in there. Now obviously I have to let that dry for a while because otherwise it will move and I don't want it to move. So there's another block of the hot glue. I'm going to put my decoration in the centre here. So just a little bit of the hot glue. And I have a little gem to put in the centre just there. I can do that one while that's waiting. Okay, this is cooled down enough for me to touch it now, so can press that down. All right, there we are. And I can trim off the ends here, like that. And like that. Right. There we are, we're getting there. Now what I want to do is put on another decor panel over the top and just match up to the edges. Uh, in trouble of final glue guns is the wires get in the way. So when I turn it, I have the flower on the front. I'm going to put a little dab of the glue on the back of another jam. Press that to the centre. If you get any odd little strings of glue, you can just pull them away. So, the card then actually stands up and the flower is suspended. So that's how I want it to be. A bit difficult for you to see, possibly from overhead point of view, but basically it's like so. And I think that's rather pretty. 